You can see we have one chase aircraft there. We have, okay, there's our tow chute. So our tow chute is out. Um, it's held on, anchored to the aircraft right now. In a moment, the crew will release and it will pull out our two extraction chutes. And there are our two extraction chutes about to pull out the pallet. There's the pallet with separation on the PTV right there. Now we have static line deployed two programmers. Now those two programmers will stabilize the vehicle and get us to the right altitude, attitude, and velocity for us to begin the test. The test will begin with severing those programmers for that 12 second free fall. Now the vehicle is unstable at these speeds. So we have software on board that will monitor the rates and the attitudes of the vehicle to make sure that we don't tumble forward. We don't want to tumble the vehicle. Um, that would be bad for our um, drogues to be deployed at apex forward. So our software will monitor the, oh, there's our free fall. So if you want, you can count to 12. Um, looks pretty stable. That's looking great. You will soon see the two drogues or excuse me, three forward bay covers. There they go. They lift off the cover. The cover separated, two border deployed drogues. You can see lots of debris in the air. Those are the lids, the bags, uh, other equipment. So now we're riding these two drogues. They are reefed. That means that we have a line wrapped around the skirt of the parachute, constricting the diameter of the chutes to modulate our drag area, to reduce our loads, and to kind of help with an orderly inflation. So now we're going to ride these drogues down, drogues down to as low as we possibly can. The actual Orion vehicle with our astronauts in it will descend to the ocean, which is at zero feet mean sea level. Here at Yuma, we're at about 1,500 feet mean sea level. There's the... Uh, three pilots, three mains. Now these will inflate through reefing stages similar to the drogues. It's more pronounced on these mains. So you can see a light bulb shape there in the three mains. This is looking really good so far. Now we're into the second stage. They're a little bigger. And if you listen closely, you can hear those mains inflating. And there we go to the full open. Beautiful shot right there. Three mains spread out. You can hear the crowd in the back cheering. We're not quite done yet. There's still a lot of stuff in the air. Um, eventually we'll see the cover come racing by and impact the desert floor. But here you can see the three mains um, bouncing in and out. That's completely expected. 